Hi guys, Prime Whiskey here. Today uh, we're going to do a whiskey with cheese parry. Because uh, when I do host tastings, I always uh, try to bring some cheese to the tasting since it's very, very appreciated. And uh, I tried a lot of different cheese, but uh, I always uh, seem to come back to the same one. It's the Swiss uh, cheese, uh, Grier or Grier. I don't know how it's uh, pronounced, but you, know, you can see the cardboard here. Uh, okay, uh, so this video today is going to be about uh, which whiskey is the best pairing with this cheese. So no uh, cheese tasting, but whiskey tasting with cheese. Okay. So I think we have a bunch of 18 year olds here. We have a Glenmorangie 18 year old, we have the Long Row 18 year old, and we have the Talisker 18 year old, and we have the Bullmore 18 year old. So we have a non peated, medium peated, and heavily peated. So let's start off with the Glenmorangie. Pour a little dram like this. And we start off by. Uh, Tasting the whiskey. Excellent stuff, by the way. Glenmorangie, 18 year old. A small piece of cheese. It's uh, a match in heaven, this cheese with whiskey. It's amazing. It uh, increases the flavors in the whiskey in a very positive way. So, um, Yeah, the whiskey combined with the cheese is uh, golden flavor for your mouth. And uh, really good. Uh, I often prefer uh, peated whiskey with this cheese. I think it uh, brings out even more uh, good flavors. Uh, but uh, this was uh, pretty damn good as well. Yeah. Um, let's try a peated one. Take some water in between. I'll take a new glass and we'll go for the... We can go with the Talisker 18 year old. The Talisker and the Bowmore are similar in the uh, peat level. So uh, we can go with the Talisker. Yeah, now we have some peat and the uh, classic uh, Talis here at year old. Take a piece of cheese again. Have small, uh, the feather flavor lingers on from the Talis here. Really, it comes uh, integrated with the cheese already in the aftertaste. Then we take a sip. Yeah, this even wor works even better uh, in my mouth. Um, this was very good, but when you have the peats and the cheese, is uh, the uh, the cheese is very uh, what do you call it uh, nutty uh, in flavor. Um, yeah, very good. Okay, moving on. Take another glass, and we do the my personal favorite with the, with this cheese, the Swiss Gruyere cheese is uh, the Long Row 18 year old. It's uh, really a match in heaven. We'll take some uh, take some water. Yeah, we sip the Long Row. Oh, amazing stuff. Extremely excellent dram. Okay, take the cheese. Mm. Perfect. Take a sip of the eight year old. Yeah, the, there you have the marriage. For me, it works fine with any whiskey because. Um, 
the cheese is so good but um, for me the long row 18 year old is uh, really a match in heaven with this cheese so uh, if you have the opportunity uh, I will put up uh, the cheese uh, uh, up here somewhere so you can see what cheese this is uh, I don't know the availability around the world but here in Europe anyway you can get it um, so uh, haven't you tried whiskey and cheese you should really do it because yeah it uh, increases the flavors of the whiskey and uh, the cheese so cheese sorry cheers <laughs>